I welcome you to today's session of the Wells of Wisdom. Um, this session is going to be very brief, but I can assure you it's going to be a very powerful one. And so today we, we are looking at what I've captioned as the power of perspective. The power of perspective. And so quickly, um, let, let's go through what when we say perspective, what does it really mean? Now, the Merriam's Webster Dictionary defines perspective as your mental view. Of the things in your environment how you mentally view things around you now in recent times one of the things I have come to re- re- discover and acknowledge is the fact that your perspective is one of the powerful tools that influences a man's life and for many people who have come to understand how perspective works it, it has blessed people to, to excel and ascend heights that other people have not been able to. And so quickly, I want, to, I want to tell you a story from the scriptures as we always do. Now, in the book of Numbers chapter number 13, I want to read from verse um, 31. From verse 31, Numbers 13, 31. So verse 31 says, But the men that went up with him said, we be not able to go up against the people for they are stronger than we 32 says and they brought up an evil report of the land which they had searched unto the children of israel saying the land through which we have gone to search it is a land that eateth up the inhabitants thereof and all the people that we saw in it are men of great stature. Now verse 33. It says, And there we saw the giants, the sons of Anak, which come of the giants. And we were in our own sight as grasshoppers. <laughs> and so we were in their sight. This, and we were in our own sight. As grasshoppers, and so we were in their sight. Now, these are people who were sent to spy the land of Canaan, and they came back with a report. Now, just so you know, it is not all of them, but these are a section of the people that went. This is the report they came with that look, the people are so huge, and we we saw ourselves as, as grasshoppers in their eyes, and so we were in their eyes. See, one of the most, um, um, one, one form of failure and one of the most strongest forms of resistance and restriction is one that you impose on yourself. You see, how far you can go is determined by what you think of yourself, how you see yourself, your perspective of yourself. These people saw giants on the land. That's okay. But the problem is not the giants. The problem is how you see yourselves in front of the giants. He said, we saw ourselves as grasshoppers. How do you see yourself? How do you see yourself? Look, the way people see you and the things people say about you are not as powerful as how you see yourself and what you think of yourself. Look, one time God wanted to bless Abraham and he uses the power of perspective. He says, Abraham, look, as far as your eyes can see, that is the extent to which I have given you. He didn't say, that is what I'm even going to give you. He says, as far as you can see, that is how far I have given you to possess. And so, Abraham, how did he even become the father of nations? He didn't see with his optical eyes. How far? Where can you stand and see the entire world? It is not possible. But there is a way to see and see the entire world. It is a matter of perspective. It is is a mental image. 
you close your eyes and you picture all the things around you. And you say, this is how far I can go. If you can see yourself arriving in your future, I tell you, fear a man who sees his tomorrow. See, the Bible tells us in something in Genesis 11. These, these people wanted to build the Tower of Babel. And God gave a testimony about these people. He says, the people are one. And nothing they have imagined will be restrained from them. This is the testimony of God concerning the imaginations of men. That when there is unity of purpose, no imagination shall be restrained. That is how powerful perspective is. So how do you see yourself? Begin to change your perspective. Sometimes you'll be confronted with things that look like huge problems and you just don't know how to deal with them. You can deal with them through your perspective. Perspective is a sure way that can lead you out of troubles and usher you into the realm of success. I hope you're encouraged by this piece and that you're shaping your perspective and how you see yourself. Thanks for watching.